Uh, okay. Is it banana? This looks like that. No bit smash. Okay. <laughs> What's the quality of this exactly? Is this source? God. Nintendo. Somebody's gonna get revealed. It's okay. We're just seeing all the Fire Emblem characters. And evil people. Wow, okay. Dragon Quest guy. <laughs> the hero. <laughs> he doesn't really have a name. I don't think so, at least. You got another very reveal. Wow, everybody's evil. And they got the Dragon Quest 8 one. Oh my. Okay, okay, okay. These are skins, I bet. Okay. I think these are skins. That's pretty cool. Oh, that's cool. RPG mechanics. Kamikaze. Oh, you get to see all of them. Summer. And of course they're gonna tie that in with their Dragon Quest XI Switch version. It's too god dang early, dude, for this. Hello everyone, I'm Yoshiaki Koizumi from Nintendo. In this Nintendo Direct for E3 2019, we'll showcase a variety of games. So we're gonna see more Fire Emblem. Probably Bayonetta 3. To the next game, Maybe Metroid 4. Like to introduce first. <laughs> what? What are you doing here? <laughs> We don't understand you, Bowser. Wait, 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 wait. Wait a minute. There's been a bit of a mix-up. You're not the right Bowser. Oh yeah, his last name's Sorry, Bowser. But I'm the right Bowser for this presentation. <laughs> oh. 
Not this way. No, no. <laughs> this way. Bye bye. Maybe next time. <laughs> Are you related? No, but we get that. This a lot. is their new guy. Well, let's get back to it. Please take it away. Hi everyone, I'm Doug Bowser from Nintendo of America, and I'm thrilled to join you for today's Nintendo Direct. This is our chance to show the world we have games for every type of player <laughs> on Nintendo Switch. Whether you love action, RPGs, or you're just looking for something new, we've got you covered. Oh yeah, maybe let's show okay. off Astro Chain. So let's get a look at one of those games by... A Netflix? What? Okay. Dark, the dark crystal? Wow, that's a surprise. And it's a tactics game? What? Okay. And you got like, okay, environmental hazards. Let's all agree to meet back at the monastery exactly five okay. years from today. Like a class reunion? You will come, won't you? Years ago, we fought here as classmates. As big class God, reunions go, dude. this one's got to be the worst in history. What should we do, teacher? Kill every last one of them! Still, we have no choice but to eliminate those who cling to unreasonable ideas of justice. Someone must put a stop to the cycle of the strong trampling the weak. So the fell star consumes even the darkness itself. Yet we have the strength to scale the walls between us, to reach out our hands in friendship so we can open our true hearts to one another. That's how we win! My teacher. Both sides of time are revealed to you. What shall you do? How lovely it would be for this moment to last forever. I thought Christina V was voicing Edo Guard. Is that Switch her mom? Is the only gaming console you can play not only on your TV at home, but anywhere you go. In fact, with a system like this, it might be fun to play Resident Evil at a location like this. Which one? Which Resident Evil are we talking about here? That looks like seven. This looks like seven. No lights. No lights. Or I could be totally wrong. <laughs> okay. Oh, you dead. Oh no. Damn. Did it just eat him? It's gonna come back. Okay, 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 okay. Oh. 
Did I get it? I got it. Oh, I knew it. Don't forget your switch. Okay, five, okay. And six, that's weird. Resident Evil. Yeah, you forgot your switch, didn't you? <laughs> Playing a Resident Evil game in a place like that might not be my way to play, but I bet you could find your way to play, don't you think? For now, please take a look. Was today oh, more heroes? July? If not, is the Empire striking back or This what? is no more heroes. Looks like things are gonna get weird today. Hey, she! I think there's no more heroes. <laughs> yep. <laughs> As you can see, things got all funky real quick. There's probably some planet eating type do Travis, good to see you again, but in an actual an actual sequel. But don't you worry. A hero descends. What? There are no heroes in this world? Oh, but there totally are. My name is Travis Touchdown. I'm the last hero around, here to save the world. I'm also just a passing assassin. Now let's do this. Start the game. This is some good news. Welcome back, Travis, to the Garden of Madness. They didn't say anything about exclusivity, huh? Well, we'll have to see the news or something. This is Kaiser. He led an elite team of Contras during the war. Hungry Beast! HB is actually a cyborg. This he might be Contra. Aw, oh, come on. This is Miss Harakiri looks... and her alien gut bucket. They survived by merging together during the alien Oh, Aw, this is Konami's game. The come on. The sweetest this might be Contra. And it does not look good. Yeah. This looks... This graphically looks really bad. Like PS3. What the heck? What the babe? Oh, Konami. The freak. Okay, well, you got that coming out, but what the F? Damn it, Machina. Oh, a lot of things going on. I have arrived. Don't give up. Begin the mission. It's your call, rookie. The battle's already started. If you get in our way, we will eliminate you. A new awakening draws nigh. That's so Japanese it hurts. With a mix. Oh my god, frame rate's going down. Or bit rate. That's 
prequel. September 13th. Okay. What? Are you kidding me? Who wants Panzer Dragoon now? Wait, what? What? Panzer Dragoon. <laughs> so it's not all my Microsoft? Oh, we have Sega, of course. What was that cruddy one by Microsoft? Konnichiwa. Hello, I'm Shinya Takahashi from Nintendo. Earlier this month, we held a Pokemon Direct for the latest games in the series. Pokemon Sword, Pokemon Shield. And Pokemon Shield. The developers from Game Freak showcased the new Gala region, the location of your new adventure, and some new Pokemon you'll encounter there. It will be a while until these games launch, so please stay tuned. By the way, in these games, you can use certain functions yeah. of the Pokeball Plus accessory, allowing you to take a Pokemon from one of these games out for a stroll through the real world with you. You may not be able to use the device as a game controller, but if you spend some quality time with a favorite Pokemon of yours, then something good might happen. In the Nintendo booth at this year's E3, fans can play Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield for the first time anywhere in the world. In this gameplay demo, you can challenge one of the gyms in the Gala region, the one and only wow. water gym, where the water type gym leader Nessa will be there waiting for you. I like the design. This year's show, I encourage you to experience a battle between Dynamax Pokemon, which is an advanced strategy from this region. Also, Immediately after this Nintendo Direct, stay tuned for live gameplay of Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield on Nintendo Treehouse Live. And now I'd like to shift gears. Please have a look at this. This is a uh, Astro Chain. Yeah, this is the one I really want. I've been waiting for you. As you know, Earth is currently under extra-dimensional attack. Chimeras. Like the ones you've just seen for the first time. At this rate, all of humankind will be pulled into the Chimera's dimension. We're facing down the end of the world. Through blood, sweat, and years of research, we finally made it. The ultimate counter chimeric weapon. By neurologically syncing captured chimeras with human operators, we established control and made powerful allies. I'm referring, of course, to the legions. I'll give you some parting advice. Your power. It's not the blessing you think it is. When a Legionis and a Legion are perfectly synchronized, it's like they're two parts of one body. No use! The override release isn't going through! That's impossible! And when half of that body is about to die, the Legion's survival instincts kick in to save it. No way! There's no way! What good could this possibly be? It's a long shot, but it's the only shot we have! It's all up to you, my friend. A blessing from the Legion. Or maybe I should say, a curse. We can't, can't turn, turn back, back now. now. I've got to know the whole truth. truth. He's still alive out there. Yes. August 30, alright. Dang, man. Stop. 
So many games! Oh, it's Animal Crossing. Okay. Sorry, it's been a while since I've played this game. <laughs> My last one was DS, so... start off in the tent and then you get a cottage and your oh god your bill <laughs> the PTSD originally we announced this title as a 2019 release however we need to more smash what the heck are you gonna do? Not a reveal? Benji can see like, oh, what a troll. What a effing troll. It's actually Benji can see. <laughs> wow. Well, Max is gonna be sad. Yeah. And the witch. It's only right for rare for a rare character to meet characters that rare help make a game for, which was Donkey Kong Country. Alright! Haha, <laughs> Banjo is silly. Alright, Nintendo! <laughs> That's like a B. Yeah, it's like a B. Well, like, there's like a good amount of game for Nintendo players. That obviously wasn't Duck Hunt silhouette, was it? Yeah. I'm excited for Astro Chain, so... For more information about DLC and, um, in the No More Heroes 3, As so... As for Nintendo Switch, we have more games in development beyond what we've shown you today. I'm looking forward to the day we can introduce them to you. Speaking of... Before we end this direct... I actually have one more thing to show you. Thank you very much for watching. Until next time. The uh, heck? Is this Metroid? It's not Metroid. The Witch of Zelda? Legend of Zelda expansion?
it's Ganon. Oh boy, here we go again. The sequel, huh? Okay. Alright, so that was Nintendo's conference. Uh, pretty good, actually. Um, I'd give it like a B, and uh, which is about on par with Square Enix, because Square Enix got carried by Final Fantasy VII. But Nintendo had a lot of cool stuff that makes me really want to get a Switch now. So, first off, um, games that intrigued me, Trials of Mana, which, was, which is also coming on PS4, I hear. Um, Panzer Dragoon, it's getting remade. I don't know it, but I recognize it, so I really want to try that out. Then there's Astro Change, which is probably on my like number one list for Switch games, which is uh, made by Platinum Games, and Platinum Games has like a great pedigree in games. They hardly make misses, unless you count Legend of Korra. They're pe but they usually make really fun games, and this one looks really cool. There was No More Heroes 3, I'm excited. They didn't mention anything about exclusivity. Um, since uh, No More Hero, uh, what was it, Travis? That Travis spin-off game that came out on the Switch like uh, like a few months back. It's also coming on the PS4 and PC, I hear. So I feel like this is like time exclusive or something. But uh, it's cool to see Travis back in an actual sequel. There's Resident Evil 5 and 6, which I thought was kind of weird at first, but now that I think about it, all the other Resident Evils are coming. I was bummed out we didn't get to see like new Switch models, like more powerful ones in that matter, because um, when I saw the Resident Evil 5 and 6 games uh, with their trailers, you can kind of see like the pixelation and the compromising um, with games like Alien Isolation, Doom Eternal, and Wolfenstein. It's starting to kind of look like, you know, how PS4 games on the PS4 games when they make on PS4 versus like something on the Vita. So it's starting to look like that again. So I was like, um. And, you know, the game's probably gonna run at 30 with the more, um, more graphical games. What else was there? There was Pokemon. I'm kind- I kind of dropped out of Pokemon around X and Y, but it kind of makes me want to play it because the waifu, you know, Nessa, uh, she looks great. <laughs> and what else? Mmm, we get games like- oh, Animal Crossing? Last time I played Animal Crossing was the DS version, so we'll see. We'll see about that one. There's Fire Emblem, I'm really intrigued. I was kind of alarmed that they replaced um, Christina V with Tara Platt, because I, like, I heard the, the Mitsuru voice, I was like, wait, what? So that's I'm kind of bummed out about that, but the game looks great story-wise, so it's, it's gonna have like, um, like, you get to play in the school part, and then five years later, uh, it'll take part um, when they, when the students you've taught have grown up, and now they have their own, own s armies and stuff, which is <laughs> that's gonna be fun. So probably multiple endings there. In regards to Smash stuff, uh, they reveal the hero from Dragon Quest, like all of them, <laughs> all of the Dragon Quest heroes. Like they're probably gonna be skins, but my enjoyment of that character reveal was kind of tarnished because of the news regarding the composer for Dragon Quest being like an iffy man, you know? So I was hearing the music like, oh man, it kind of ruined that for me. But it was kind of made up with the Banjo-Kazooie, Banjo and Kazooie reveal, and um, which is Microsoft. So they made, they somehow made it work and they bought, brought a character that, or they brought a character from a company that worked on a Nintendo game. So, Rare worked on the Donkey Kong Country games on the SNES. So, and I believe Ben and Kazooie was on the Nintendo 64. So, you know, they, it, it's kind of fitting that you get to have a Rare character since the company worked on a Nintendo game in the past. And the reveal was kind of trolly because uh, the, the um, dog from Duck Hunt was like laughing uh, when they were revealing the Benji Kazooie silhouette. It was actually the dog from Duck Hunt. So yeah, I think that's it that I that caught my interest. So Nintendo gets a B. Um, 
pretty much in the same like great range uh, for Square Enix because they were carried by Final Fantasy. And there's a lot of games. There's a lot of games that I'm looking forward to. So it might be about time for me to buy a Switch. I just need a really good sale. So that's all I gotta say for that matter. Thank you guys for watching. Please leave a like or subscribe or comment down below. And I'll catch you guys later. See ya.